Absolutely, yeah. it won't. So, concerning the one that uh, happened last week, uh, the withdrawal of uh, Dr. Esekwesili from the presidential race, is there any law that says she cannot do what she did? No, there's no law that uh, says she cannot withdraw at any time. But there is guideline. If you go to Section 35 of the Electoral Act, it provides the period within which to withdraw and to enable the political party to replace you. That provision said not later than 45 days to the date of the election. By the time she withdrew, we have gone beyond that provision of the law. So she can go not contest, but she will be on the ballot. INEC cannot remove her. She cannot remove herself. But the logo of the political party will be on the ballot. And that was why when I appeared in your program before the end of first of I said, look, these people that are supporting the president, supporting pres Vice President Atiku, they have opportunity to withdraw. You cannot be supporting any of those candidates and you're on the ballot. I say withdraw. That was the very week our own presidential candidate, Lucio Mimiko, after consultation, will say go to the Senate. If you have not withdrawn 45 days to the date of the election, based on Section 35 of the Electoral Act, all you are doing is uh, razzmatazz. So is it a nullity for the ACPN to now support, uh, to endorse the president? Well, it, it, they can endorse anybody. Even with their president, there are many of them in the list that, are, that will be on the ballot for presidential election. They will support one presidential candidate or the other. Okay. It has been the practice because most of them do these things for pecuniary reasons. Yeah, uh, Chamberlain, you know, INEC is crying more than they believe. They are playing the ostrich as far as Madame Obia's question to withdraw is concerned. Number one, Section 33 of the Electoral Act provides for two grants upon which a candidate can withdraw. That is debt and voluntary withdrawal. Now, in Section 35, he said such voluntary withdrawal shall be made 45 days before the date fixed for an election. Now, the import of that section 35 is that if there is any withdrawal uh, uh, shorter than 45 days to the date fixed for an election, the, the import is that the political party that sponsored obvious equity cannot be allowed to feed candidate. Not that she can, not that she can withdraw. She, she no, cannot no, withdraw. No, 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 no. That's the import. No, 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 that no, is no. the provision. Don't, 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 don't misinform me. Oh, it is you that is misinforming no, 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 A <laughs> candidate. I have my floor. I have my floor. When you are talking, I kept quiet. I have my floor. It is not for INEC to say that she cannot withdraw, that her name must be on ballot. Because if you say her name must be on ballot, remember yesterday or two days ago, a high court in Zamfara State said that AP, there should be APC candidates in the ballot. I next said they are studying it. What it means is that if I next study it to the extent that, because there was another federal high court, there was a judgment from Abuja here, stating that I next should not allow APC candidate from Zamfara State. I next now told those that are studying it. The implication is that, and if I next said, okay, we have studied, we are inclined to obey the order that came from Zamfara, I next will now put the, the okay. name of Zamfara uh, uh, APC on the ballot. Okay. Now, how can I next now say that a candidate who has withdrawn from a race that the, the, the person's name must be dead. Okay. But those are two, 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 two different scenarios. Uh, so it's not two very different scenarios. No, if they are printed, the, the let, essence of that section 45 is that. The essence of that right, section 45. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's shape this one. Go ahead, please. You, you, see, you, see, you see, I don't want us to uh, stay here and misinform the public. I will not do that. INEC is in order because section 35 is explicit. You have been given a window to withdraw a window to replace the person withdrawn. Yes, you have withdrawn. You are not running. But nobody can replace you. Nobody can replace you under the law. When a law or an enactment provides that something must be done in a particular manner, if that thing is not done in that manner provided by the law, in the eyes of the law, that thing has not been done. Okay. So okay. if 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 they want, they can go and support anybody. In the case of Zamfara State, if the court decides that Zamfara should come, are you saying as a lawyer, I could not obey court order, even though it may be another procured for a particular purpose. You didn't get now there is another you order. Just, 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 just a minute. Where? There's another order here. I say don't take it. So there are two orders conflicting. 
of your okay. jurisdiction. Let's bring in our, our colleague in Lagos. He's got a question. Yeah, uh, Mr. Uh, sorry, Chief I want to I want to start with you, and then I'll go to uh, Mr. Nene. The this scenario of um, Dr. Ezekwesili, is there any precedent in our political history and what is the implication going forward? <laughs> any precedent in our political history? Any precedent in our political history? Well, well, this is the first time she came out. This, this is the first time she came out to contest. I mean, and any, in any, in any, any right political history contest. before now, has there what been I'm any such is thing what is before in now? The law. And that thing that is in the law is saying that you have a window to withdraw. And if you don't withdraw within that window, it will amount to nothing, absolutely nothing. The party cannot replace you, and the party's logo will be on the ballot. Don't forget, it is not the individual that contests election per Amechi and Einek. Supreme Court says it is the political party. And that is why when you look at the ballot papers, you don't see the name of individuals. What you see is the logo of the political party. So that amounts to nothing in my view. And that has been the practice. It is not only in conformity with the law, it is in conformity with the practice. But if you are not that comes tomorrow, for example, and say, Einek, allow that party to feed another person. Einek will obey the other. But those of us in the field who have been in this game for... 15, 13, 15 years, we know that it is wrong. So INEC must always obey court order. So let nobody disparage INEC that INEC has done what is in tandem with the practice and the provision of Section 35 of the Electoral Act. Mr. Nene, I'd like to uh, pose the same questions to Mr. Nene. Do we have any history of any contestant, especially maybe presidential or even gu gubernatorial contestant, in our political history? ever backing down at the last minute beyond the, the regulation of the law? As far as I know, I don't think uh, there is such precedent in the past. It is a very novel case. But having said that, Section 35 of the Electoral Act did not uh, authorize INEC to insist that when a candidate withdraws, that INEC must put that candidate's names on the ballot paper. The essence of 45 days given by that section is to enable INEC adjust their ballot paper. The essence of that section, 45 days, is to make room for the political party whose candidate has voluntarily withdrawn to replace her. In this case, Madam Obeze said, I am not interested. INEC is not empowered by any law, no matter how political coloration we give it, by any law to insist that a, that a candidate for an election who has voluntarily withdrawn less than 45 days of the election must go on. The issue is that INEC will not allow the political party that sponsored that candidate to provide another candidate to substitute her. Chief, let me ask you. I mean, That's the law. The time that uh, during the 2015 elections, we saw that uh, when, unfortunately, uh, 